Yo, this your boy Jose Perales. I decided to take a trip across Thailand and I'm taking y'all with me. Let's go. I gotta give that, I gotta give her credit. She's a good dog. I was wondering why she was just looking at me. I was wondering why she was just looking at me. She knows I got food. I was like, why is she just looking at me? She came out looking, she's so sad. But she didn't, she didn't try to steal the food. She could have, if she was a crazy one, she could have just grabbed the bags and just took off, but she didn't. She's a good dog. Look at that brother, he's cute. You know, Thailand really, it's interesting with the whole dog thing, you know. Could you come to Thailand and possibly not have one dog bark at you? I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> You could try to go to resorts, you could, you know, you could try to go to the most fancy resorts. But even at some resorts, I went on the beach and there's been like a dog, like you could not have, you could probably come to Thailand and not have one dog bark at you at all. Um, that being said, it's, uh, you know, if you're prideful and you're like, I don't want to no, let no damn dog bark at me. <laughs> It, it's gonna challenge it's gonna it's gonna humble you it's gonna test your pride you know I love dogs I just don't like you know it's like I like kids but I'm not gonna have no kid acting a damn fool around me that's tough you know and so the thing is is just like kids are like dogs right the owners are you know they're more patient and you know, a lot of parents are gonna let their, let their kids act inappropriate and they're gonna put up with it and owners are gonna, you know, their dogs might bark at you and they might, you know, they might tell them not to, but it, it's just dogs are funny because they wanna come over here and they wanna lay next to my motorbike. Maybe it's just the sunshine. Maybe this is their favorite spot, but like they, they, they wanna come over and then I go out and then one of them acts a little bit afraid of me and then wants to bark at me. And then the owner comes back and says, like, hey. And the owner's cool. The owner's mad cool. He's a cool dude. But they want to come and they want to lay, you know. And they, they want to just, like, see what's going on. And it's like they want their little, like, drama. They they. <laughs> but these dogs, they're good dogs, you know. And, and you're going to realize that, like, you know what? Most dogs, 
bark. That's what they do. God made them that way. <laughs> but it really, for me, when I start getting mad at dogs or I start judging the behavior of dogs and their dogs, but I, I look at myself and I see sometimes like how I've acted like a damn dog, you know, in, in different ways. And it just, I don't know, maybe I'm overthinking it or maybe I'm trying to get too deep here, but maybe some people, they, they won't even notice the dogs in Thailand. <laughs> Like, I didn't see that. The, there's a boy. That's a girl right there. They're both cute. And the boy was the bigger one. I was waiting for the boy to piss on my motorbike. You're going to see, like, dogs. They're going to want to piss on your car. And I'm, I'm ready. If a dog pisses on my girlfriend's car, I'm ready to kick the shit out of them, you know? I feel like they know they ain't supposed to be pissing on people's cars because they look around or they... You know, I, I say, hey, and then they look at me and then they'll try to piss on the damn car and run. I feel like dogs are smart and they know they're not supposed to be pissing on cars, but they do the shit anyways. <laughs> but this this guy, I, maybe I missed it. Maybe he pissed on my motorbike in the morning, but I didn't see him piss on my car. I was waiting for him to piss on the motorbike, but he didn't. <laughs>